How do you make math fun? What does it even mean, fun? Fun means many things to different people. Fun might be binge watching Netflix. Fun might be going surfing. Fun might be doing math. Fun might be binge eating ice cream on a Saturday night while you're watching reality TV. It doesn't matter what fun is to you. In this video, I'm gonna tell you how you can actually make math fun. Because people like things that are fun, and so people do things that are fun. So therefore, if you make math fun, you will like math, and you will do more math, and you will become better at math. So how do you make it fun? Well, try to think about what actually makes math fun. So you sit down, you look at a problem, you read the question. A lot of times you don't even understand what the question is saying. You know, you're just reading it and struggling to understand. That, that's a struggle. For most people, that's not fun. That requires some, some work. But try to appreciate what you're learning while you're doing this. That makes it a little bit more fun. So as you're struggling and as you're reading, tell yourself, hey, you know, it's okay. This is supposed to be hard. I am supposed to struggle. And then every time you understand a little piece of the question, remind yourself, hey, oh, I see what they're asking now. I finally understand what it, what it means when they say fix k greater than zero. What does that mean? I now understand what that part of the question is saying. So every time you gain a little bit of understanding in your math problem solving process, remind yourself that you've just accomplished something. It's these little accomplishments that you get along the way. And eventually, eventually you'll figure out the problem. Eventually, that is the defining moment of fun when you're able to actually completely figure out a math problem. It doesn't matter if it's a, a, a more basic problem like solving a quadratic equation with the quadratic formula, which does take learning, right? You have to learn that at some point in your life. Or if it's something a little more advanced than say algebraic topology or, or just regular topology, it doesn't matter the level of math that you're working on because you still go through that process, that process of struggling and reading and struggling to understand the little pieces and just appreciate appreciate those little accomplishments as you work through the problem. And at the end, that's when it gets fun because you have a full solution. So next time you're working on math and you're, you're feeling frustrated, try to embrace what you've learned. Math is hard for everyone. People struggle in math. There's people, there are people that have a really hard time. Believe me, I'm a teacher. I have seen people struggle with math. I mean, just beyond what I could even put into words, I have seen people struggle. So if you think you're struggling, trust me, I've seen someone struggle worse. I've struggled with math. I have struggled with math my whole life. Math is challenging. So every time, every time you make those little steps, you go through those little accomplishments, realize that you've accomplished something good, and that's how you make math fun.